Welcome to another underwater adventure my beautiful viewers. After being in the water for about 15 minutes, I saw my first barracuda here. As you can see there, it's swimming with some jacks and rolling pin. I made a dive on it and took a shot. I was successful with that shot. One shot for the morning and one barracuda. That's a good start. This barracuda didn't give any trouble because it was a good shot after realizing that it was a good shot i didn't waste any time i just pull it up immediately yeah man see my flick up on a gun guys shot biting skin but he can't escape see my try box me with tail guys but i gave it a lovely shot so i didn't have to worry about anything Let's take a look at him now. Yeah man, it's a nice one. I saw some jacks and rolling pin here. I didn't see any barracuda at the moment. But I was looking around because whenever you see the jacks like that and the rolling pin, they are always swimming with barracuda. They feed from the barracudas. And the barracudas also eat them as well. So they are swimming around with barracudas and barracudas eat them. So barracuda is a lucky fish. Yeah man, them, them pray. Swim with them sometimes. So right here, I made a dive on it. You see my guan guys? He whoy like a deer in gun. So I didn't get any chance with that one. 30 minutes after, Marcus called me saying barracudas were coming. These were the barracudas. I saw four of them, but he said it was six of them. The bigger one was closest to me. So I made a dive on it, a gentle dive. But this fish was wild as well. Yeah man, the fish them have come up very very wild since recently. So I didn't get any chance with him. After they swam off, Marcus chased them on some deeper waters. They stopped and gave him a little bit of hope so just as he make the dive on them the big one start to act up again he's the leader so the rest of them is following him so every time they stop and Marcus try to make a dive the big one swim off as you can see there they are heading away from him <laughs> As you can hear, Marcus was calling me there. After they swam off from him, he continued the chase and brought them back on some shallower waters where I was waiting for them. So this is my footage of them. So I made a dive on the big one again because he was closest to me. This time, I was saying I was going to take a long range shot no matter what and I did. And it caught it in the tail. But it swam off with a piece of speed like a missile. And the spear fell out, so we lost that fish. Marco saw a huge grunt here, so he made a dive to see if he could find it. The barracudas are very, very wild today. We saw quite a few of them, but they weren't given any chances. Guys, please remember to leave a like on the video. That helps us out a lot and it's free. And also, please remember to watch the ads. If you don't know, that is how we make a revenue. Marcus didn't see the ground here. He searched the rock properly, but it went up in the rock. So he just head back for the surface. Let's get back to the barracuda hunting now. This dive was for our scribs. Lion fishermen love these because this is what they use to catch barracudas. A lot of persons eat them, but I have never eaten them before. 
I hear that they are nice. But whenever we spear them, we normally give them to line fishermen. We don't eat them. Have you ever eaten them before, guys? If you have, leave a comment and let me know. And also let me know how you think they taste. Marco size first barracuda here. This one wasn't as wild as the rest. This one had a full stomach. While cleaning it up, I took a jack out its belly, one entire jack. Marcus gave it a lovely shot here. It was a spine shot. Same a tremble. Yeah man. However, Marcus didn't trust the shot. He wasn't confident that his gill hold the fish so he could pull it up. So right there he asked me to give it a second shot. I made this dive and I did give it a second shot. However, it came off his spear but it didn't go anywhere. It couldn't swim because it was a spine shot. So while I gave it the second shot, it was there in the open no spear inside of it but it just cannot move i gave it the second shot but it was a thin shot so marco set up and gave it another shot so while we wait for marcus to give it the third shot i have a riddle for you guys yeah man i have a riddle so the last time i gave you guys a riddle a lot of you got it correct so this time i'm going to give you a little bit i want one a little bit more difficult all right so let's see who can get this one all right riddle me this riddle me that what has four fingers and a thumb but isn't alive it's not a living thing all right and i am going to give you guys a clue you're always seeing us with them so yeah man that's the clue i'm giving you let me see what all these smart people them know jump in at the comment section and tell me what's the answer yeah one must can get that one guys one must can get that one because yeah hey, you guys most can get that one we not give you any other clue but based on the clue i gave that one should be easy if i didn't give any clue it would have been harder but it's easy based on the clue so this is my footage of me giving the barracuda the second shot so right there marco spears slip out you can see that see the spear empty but the barracuda is still on the ground Watch out, him. I try to swim in him, but he can't move, guys. Yeah, man, that's what spine shot does. Yeah, man, he can't swim. Funny thing, though, I still gave it a thin shot. I don't know what happened there. I was acing it too much. This is Marcus going to give it the third shot. If barracudas weren't that dangerous, we could have just picked it up. But due to our dear nature, we cannot just pick them up like that. Yeah man, we have to give them the shots that are required. You don't know? Safety first. Yeah man, we now run no risk with barracudas. And none of we want to get bitten by them. Yeah man, they teeth very very sharp. If that barely rub against your flesh, yeah man his flesh gone as you can see here it was a lovely one by now you guys should have left their comments already 
I can't wait to see the answer so I don't give you no guys yeah man I can't wait I enjoy reading the comments please remember again guys to leave a like on the video this helps us out a lot more than you know and for all our loyal viewers we appreciate you guys and also our new viewers we appreciate all of you guys thanks for clicking on the video and watching this was Marco's second Barracuda he took a shot at it but he wasn't successful let's look at his footage now it was two of them the first one passed so he focused on the second one he took a shot but the shot fell short I saw another Barracuda coming here so I called Marcos so that we could pen it. <coughs> After it saw me, it turned around and head off, so we didn't get any chance with that one. Right here, Marco saw some more barracudas and called me. I was closest to them, so I made the first dive. This is my footage of the dive. See that guys, four lovely barracudas. There's a giant one there, you know. You don't know, you know, that one they may offer, you know. They were restless, so I wasn't pressing them. I was watching them to see if they would stop. Because they are very wild today. Finally, they went beside those stones and stopped for a little. So I decided this was my chance. So I made this dive on them. My main focus was to spear the bigger one. And I did so. You see him out woke up guys like him bad. So I took a good aim. And I gave it a lovely shot. It was a great placement. Marcus realized that it was a good shot. So he started to chase one of the other ones. I will show you that footage in a second. I know that I gave this barracuda a good shot, so I started to pull it up. Look what happened. You see that? He make a rush up, guys. Look at this. Watch out. He frightened me, you know, watch out. You see that? I thought it was going to rush me, so I let go the shooting line. Well, not the shooting line, the track card. So I gave it too much lens, and it swam out there. It swam up on the water tap and the spear slide out of it guys. I was so upset. This was the last barracuda we saw for the morning. This one was the smallest one so far. It saw me and was trying to use the rock corner to escape. But I was like not today. I took a shot at it. And I did spear it. It was a body shot. See that? He start going wicked, guys. Yeah, man. He start swim up all about the place. I had to be watching it while heading back for surface. I realized that the shooting card went through it, so I didn't have to worry. It cannot escape. Marcus heard the shot and came over to give it a second shot so when he made this first dive it swam off yeah man it has swim with me spear you know an 8 mm spear you know guys yeah, so this barracuda is strong but it cannot go anywhere so this is me in the distance holding the card because i didn't want to swim behind it so it swam off i just hold the card so that marcus could give it the second shot He did, and then he pulled it up. As you can see there, he's coming towards me with it. It was still on my spear, it couldn't escape. So this is him guys 
Yeah, man, a nice barracuda. We didn't see any more barracudas, but I saw the shark. It was a massive amide shark. We see them on a regular basis, but sometimes they are moving too fast, so we cannot get a record of them. Join me on land now, guys. Yes, guys, we just come in. Get three lovely barracuda. See that? A nice one. Marco still there in the water, so I'm going to scale him up until he come out. So I set the camera so you can see me going with all my skill, alright? Yeah man, you don't know. You don't know say I thrown this in you know, guys. Yeah, so we scale the bar of them. We don't want to see what one already. We shoot one big one and then get to it. That one there we about 20 pounds, you know, 20 something pounds. 20 plus. We vex us guys, cha cha. It discouraged me man, we didn't want to come out of the water a long time. But I don't so life goes still. A good shot in getting you know, a guy go up on water tap and he get lock and he does slide off. Big, you know, guys, because I'm big, you know. I tell you, man. A good shot, you know. When I pull him up, I can't get bad and like you want to run up on me. So that's why I give him a little length. So I, I, that's why I get to run up on water tap. But that does so life go still. Thankful for catch. Same way. Get three lovely ones. So we're still thankful. I'm going to go and scale them up and I don't want to get paid up. So I'm going to swatch them and go on. First one this done scaler now. Knock out in teeth. I shot your eye, me have a shot my eye guys, so shot full of eye too, alright? But Mara Mara teeth flying now with the eye blind on. Samero? Finish scale up the rest of them and get paid though. Alright? Yeah man. Yes guys, so I done scale and got them now. Yeah man, so I tie them up like handbag there. So we are them up. So Marcus said just come out of the water. Yeah man. Yes, yeah, so we are going something there now. We are change off and get the good head up. So thanks for watching all of you guys. We really do appreciate. We really do appreciate you guys, yes? Alright. So that's the end of the video guys. Thanks for watching. And please remember to like, share, 